I picked up an 80 cubic foot tank today in the city. It's full of oxygen. We're going to fill this small tank. But first we're going to secure it against the wall just so it doesn't get bumped over here in the garage. Okay, it's on the wall. Put an extra strap on the bottom. So what we're gonna do is open this one to let it pressurize and then we are gonna open this to let it fill up. Because that big tank is an 1800 PSI bottle, we got up to 1800 PSI on the mountain high. It's all filled up, now I can take it in the plane. The O2D2 system right there. I mounted it beside the stick just because it's close enough to run the main line to the tank. Wasn't sure where else to put it, so I put it there. It's out of the way, I can get to it pretty easily. Right now you see it's in the off position. Hit this button, now it's on. New inverter for the airplane. The 400 watt pure sine wave inverter. Pretty nice, weighs 2.3 pounds. Two plugs, USB. We're gonna put it right where this one is right now. Just a cheap Canadian tire. And done. Welcome on board. We're going to be going flying and test out the oxygen system. It's a little windy today. About 15 knots gusting, 25. Straight down the runway. Going to Fox Charlie Delta Zoo is taking off turn runway 28, straight out for 4000, kicking lane, Fox Charlie Delta Zoo. Okay, let's go. Go pumps on. First flaps down. Second flap, little turbulent, expected. Should be further higher up, we'll see. Uh, 3,000 feet, turn the fuel pump off. There's 4,000 feet, we level off, and we have to talk to terminal. And get clearance. Max center on 34-3, good day. 34-3, walk test, 1422. Good day, Terminal, Pippa Drove here. Fox Charlie Delta Zoo, just off Cooking Lake Airport. Among those five towns along the coast, where colors came to. And Edmonton Terminal, in System 172, Gulf Indian Canada. In the Yankee Tango, Edmonton Terminal, you're identified, cleared in Class C 4500. In the Yankee Tango. And, uh, aircraft off of Cooking Lake, say identical. again. Uh, Fox Charlie, Delta Zulu. In 
Sydney Delta Zulu, Summington Terminal, Squawk 4617, go ahead. 4617, just like to go up to 16,000 feet uh, via fire to test out this new oxygen system I have. We have come to a place we can go as one. I became a father this week. And you can, you can uh, let me go any direction you want, Charlie Delta Zulu. And Charlie Delta Zulu, um, yeah, right now I've got no traffic for you, so your choice. Charlie Delta Zulu. Charlie Delta Zulu, say your type. Uh, Charlie Delta Zulu is a Pistero Virus. The, the code is PIVI. PIVI, thanks. Alright, so we're going to turn on the oxygen. I felt the turn on. Now we're going to switch over to F N. It'll automatically turn on at 10,000 feet. We'll go full throttle. I do have one target southwesty, about uh, five and a half miles. Uh, no mode C on him, so I'm not sure his uh, altitude, but it should be low level. Okay, Charlie, Delta do the thing. I think the O2D2 is starting to figure out my breathing. Time to take a breath. Feel it pumping into my nose. I wish you'd leave that place. Did you you're higher up too, you want to watch your true airspeed. Make sure you're not going over 147 knots. That's the max speed on this plane. Alright, we're at 7,000 feet. I'm going to test out the oxygen system. I've got it so it turns on automatically at 10,000 feet. Just passing 7,500 feet over the city of Edmonton. You want to make sure that you're watching your true airspeed when you're higher up like this. I was told of one story, this guy picked up his brand new Pipistrelle from the factory. He flew over the mountains with it and oversped the plane, the wings uh, went into flutter. Ailerons ripped off, and he had to use his BRS parachute to get down. So it wasn't wasn't too pleasant for his first flight. We don't want that. Climbing at 97 knots, 900 feet per minute. Outside air temperature is minus three. Now we're at 8,000 feet. There's a headwind of 36 knots up here. That's oh, minus four. Increase our climb rate. That's 8,500 feet, climbing at 1,000 feet per minute. Bill temperature's a little high, it's at 114 right now. Should be at 110 where it's comfortable. I've opened the cowl flap. I've got my oxygen tester ready. I want to test my oxygen level, make sure that this system is working. 9,500 feet. Oxygen, oxygen system should turn on pretty soon. Uh, I can feel the oxygen coming in more now. That's pretty cool that it only gives me oxygen when I need it. When I'm sucking in. It knows to pop out oxygen. Everything's looking good on the engine. We're up to 12,000 feet. This is the highest I've ever been in a small plane. Still climbing 600 feet a minute at 75 knots. It indicated. Air speed's 96. You can really see the mountains now in the background. We're only a couple hundred kilometers away, so pretty good visibility today. Engine speed. 
warping the track a little bit. Engine's running really nice. Oil pressure's a little low, but it's okay still. 14,000 feet. Still climbing. Still climbing at 700 feet a minute at 83 knots. I could get it even better if I slow us down a little bit. Climbing 900 feet a minute right now. This plane is just amazing. Performance you can get out of it. Oxygen level is 95. So we passed 15,000 feet. Canada 7040, contact coming in center 3277. Have a good day. 75 knots, climbing at 500 feet per minute. That's just incredible. The ceiling of this plane is 18,000 feet, so Approaching. I'm full fuel as well right now. It's also minus 18 now, outside. Horizon 2543, was that you call? 2543. Departure, you're identified. Climb oh, we're at 210. Turn left, direct to Tafo. 15,800 feet. And left, direct Tafo. Horizon uh, 2543. Close. 15,900 feet. And 16,000 feet. All right, look at that, guys. I'm gonna level off here. The oxygen level is 99. Heart rate 78. Looks good to me. For the best, I'm gonna call the tower and turn around. Stand back down. That tower, Fox Charlie Delta Zulu. Requesting to descend back to 4,000 feet and turn back for cooking link. I'm leaving home for the coastline Someplace under the sun Autopilot mode I feel my heart for the first time Cause now I'm moving on, yeah I'm moving on And there's a place that I've dreamed about we're heading to the for two I hear the sounds of the season and lose all sense of time. I'm far away to a sunny place where it's just you and me. Feels like we're in a dream You know what I mean The summer air by the seaside The way it fills our lungs The fire burns in the night sky This life will keep us young, yeah Keep us young we go. If you guys enjoyed the flight, that was pretty awesome. I've never flown to 16,000 in a small plane. Talk to you later. Oh, that's the biggest plane I've ever seen at Cooking Lake Airport.